We're at Keishiryo. And this is Rocio. Hello. <laughs> She's gonna show us the whole dorm because I can't go in. Yes, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. But before we go in, we're looking at the bikes yes. and the mail, right? Yes. Uh -huh. Does somebody like take care of everything? Because it's all like trimmed nice. Yeah, they do. They kind of need on I guess this is, like I said, first time me being here to <laughs> the bike area. Oh, um, wow. I'm pretty sure you do have to let the Kanyin sons know that like you have a bike so that they reserve a sure. spot. Yeah, yeah. Make sure. Do they have locks on them or you just put it in? Um, I actually don't know. Oh, I think it just holds it. Okay, Shiro, we do have to use our IDs as like our keys. Mm. So we use it to enter and to exit. We just have it here. Yeah, and you said if you forget it, you're kind of like stuck. <laughs> yeah, you have to ask them to like. This is the only place we're allowed guests in. Yeah, I can only come here. Yep, you're only allowed here. We have seating for guests, but also just if you want to hang out with people from third, second floor, like mixing up. Yeah. Um, also, we have <laughs> today a special specialty. We a have special our event. Sheet collection thing because every two weeks they um, collect our dirty sheets and then give us new ones in the afternoon. Oh, so like really the same nice. day? Yeah, the same day. So Whoa. like they have this here. Two, three hours, they'll have clean sheets out here. Um, oh. Like this thing here will be all of them. Very quick, very efficient. Yeah, and this is like a little, a little garden. A little courtyard almost, I'd say. Wow. Oh, yeah, and then we have seats to study if you want to study outside instead of inside. Nice. Um, all right. Can you show me how the mail works? Yes. And you have a code to open it. Hmm. And bam, just small. It is quite small. Yeah. <laughs> I just like snuck under your arm. Yes. Open up this and put oh. the code to open it. <laughs> Fancy. <laughs> and that's how you get your packages. Wow. Well, it's so quiet, but you said everybody's gone. Yeah, it's like end of the semester, so people have either gone back home or like some of the international students have already like left and moved out. Yeah. So, it's sad. The best thing is, this is going to be even sadder, is I can't follow you. Yeah. Unfortunately. Once she crosses this line, it's over for us. You can't. Like, you can't I can't even reach over. No, <laughs> you're not allowed. I'm so sorry. You're blocked. I'm sorry. I'm Denied sorry. Entrance. There's like a shield, like, going. Yeah, going. actually, that's how that works. <laughs> Since I can't go past this point, we're actually going to FaceTime, and then Rocio is going to do the rest of the dorm tour. Wow. Oh, <laughs> oh, it's so sad, but here's our handoff. Thank you, Rocio. Goodbye. Goodbye. I shall see you eventually. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm taking you to the common space area on the first floor. I study here quite often. Um, it's quite easy to. We have whiteboards back here. This one has a bunch of French written on it because someone was studying. <laughs> this one has like plans. We also have this big gym back here that isn't for our use, but it's for the universities. So we just that get to. So yeah, we just get to observe. Thank you. Um, so in this whole room, it's just like where you can study. Can I see you? Oh my god! <laughs> Hello. Yes. Yes. We also have this Tanabata thing here <laughs> that's been just chilling for weeks. That is so cute. <laughs> Can you give me like a corner shot like I did in this room? Yeah. Thank you, Rocio. You're the best. Let's go. Wow, she looks so big like in a corner shot. It does, doesn't it? Is it deceiving? It's a little bit, maybe. But now, here's the most important area on the first floor. This is a Jidon Hanbaiki. <laughs> um, I actually really like this like lemon one up here. It's pretty good. If you want something that isn't water. Ooh, that one is really good too. And then we have our food one that has cup ramen and bread and chocolate. <laughs> the essentials. Is there a little kitchen behind you? Um, so there's like a sink, but we do have a sign that says no use. <laughs> don't use it. No use. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know if they've ever were allowed to use it, but it's here. So hopefully at some point. <laughs> Yes, yeah. that is our little yeah. cheese on humbike area. This is such a funny way to do this. Yes, it is. 
have to we have to come up with some way to show this dorm since they're so strict. <laughs> now we're gonna go down. We won't be able to see you in the corner. And also, we have to use our IDs to get to our floors as well. <laughs> There's well, mine. Goodbye, Rocio. Goodbye. Goodbye. If our connection cuts out in the basement. <laughs> we shall see. And now we get to go downstairs. Let's go. Okay. So the first thing in the basement that we see is we have an ofuro. Um, it isn't open yet because it doesn't open until 5 p.m. And then we shall enter over here. Now we're in the basement where we have a big workshop room that is currently closed. You have to reserve it like two days in advance and they just opened it back up again. <laughs> that is where we have, we've had some of our bigger events like our holiday party. Um, and it's just a nice little big space to hang out. Ooh, so. I think I got connection now. So Yay. you're in the basement, right? Yes. Well, it's so dark. Oh, uh, yeah, there's... The lights are off. <laughs> Don't turn on. You're like in a back room episode down there. I know. Um, these are the uh, other workshops that we can use for, like, studying. Just a little glance on the inside. They just have um, two tables with, like, four chairs each. So it's literally like very minimal just to study. And is everything used a lot here? Because it's pretty quiet. Um, I feel like most things are pretty used. I know my old roommate, she would use these areas a lot during exam season. And then over there, that's the, that's the door that the boys use. <gasps> oh my god! How are you? I'm doing good. We're gonna go outside. Why is there so many locks? Okay, wait, this is actually such a nice view. You get to have it too. It's okay, girl. Welcome. So yeah, this is where we can study outside if you want to or hang out. Me and my unit mates. Oh my god, look, it's Allie. <laughs> this is so iconic. <laughs> Yeah, me and my unit mate had a hot pot party down here once where we just came out here, drank, and ate hot pot, and it was very fun. <sighs> yes. <laughs> You're welcome. And now that is everything for the basement. It's pretty, pretty simple. And like everything else in the storm, you have to have your ID card to go places. So time for me. All right, and now we are definitely gonna get cut off in the elevator. <laughs> yeah. <In here. laughs> See how long it lasts before they cut you off, but. Now we are on the third floor. This is literally the exact same layout as the second floor, which is the guy's floor. Um, obviously I can't go on the second floor, so you guys are only gonna get to see the third floor. <laughs> but we shall start over here. We're gonna be quiet to not bug the people who live here. Oh, the shower room. Guys, everyone, the shower room. Which 
I don't think anyone's going to be in here right now. We have a sink in here for you to do your stuff beforehand. And then these are what our shower rooms look like. Just like this. Do you have the thing where you turn like the temperatures on and stuff? Yeah, we do have like a, the turning, like actual knobs. Oh, okay. Ours is like a little panel where you have to type how much you want that like temperature to be. Ah, uh, no. Why is it not like that? But there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven showers. So you have the options of using the showers or the onsens? Yeah, either or. Which is nice because the shower room doesn't ever get like too crowded because people have the option. On every floor is there six showers? Seven showers. Um, I don't know what's on the first floor. I don't know if they also have seven, but <laughs> at least on the second floor they do. Is the last. But yeah, this is our common area. We have two TVs. Ooh. For us to watch things together and hang out and play Just Dance or any other game consoles that we have. Over here, over here is where we have all of our games. We have our Wii, our Switches, all the games you can so, imagine. That is so cool. Yes. Um, and then we also have this area out here where we can go outside. If you can go outside, could you show it to me? Yeah. Please. While you're doing all this cool stuff, I'm um, sitting on some random chairs. <laughs> <laughs> I was actually sitting out here earlier this morning because it's so relaxing, but it has these chairs for you to sit and also like this little balcony almost area. But yeah, it's really nice. You get the clear cloudy sky actually right now. And it's just yeah, a nice view. You can like see everything down, can't you? Yeah. Oh, you have fade, aren't you? I don't see all. This is so funny. <laughs> yes, it is a big open space. Could you just like walk me through what's in your kitchen? Yeah. I heard you have a pretty nice kitchen, so you gotta flex on me. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, actually, like I'm cool. we have like two kitchen areas. This one's like our bigger side. Um, it has, it's kind of a little bit messy right now, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Everyone's dishes are on the counter. Um, but we have sinks here every unit has their own like little drawer to put their stuff in so this one's my unit sanshi um, okay. just put anything you want in there we have rice cookers essentials obviously <laughs> we have the toasters our electric kettles microwave um and then down here is where we have our trash bins <laughs> Oh, so you just throw it in there? Yeah, we just throw it in there. We have like more on that side as well. Um, but yeah, okay. and then we have these like stove tops. Are they electric? Yes, they are. Nice. Could you give me a shot like straight down the aisle of this? Yes. Do it this way. Wow, it's so big on this side. There's so many options. <laughs> but yeah. Thank you, thank you so much. Do even oh, an angular yeah. shot. Whoa, is that more kitchen? <laughs> yeah, this this one like wraps around this corner here. Just for a little bit. It just has two extra. Um, so that's like the luxury kitchen. Yeah, this one's the bigger side. Um, and then we do have these like fridge and freezers if you need to quick store some of your stuff in here. Hey. But yeah. Have fridge in your room? We do. Dude, we have quite a big is <laughs> Yeah, it's quite big. Oh, our... Like, a of, like, this floor, like, in the yes. place, like, the area where you can see the most. Like, just walking around the center, if possible. Yes. There we go. And also go over here and try to get, like, an angle shot. <laughs> Yeah, and then over here is our um, our little hair dryer section, sinks that we share, mirrors, hello. <laughs> so 
So our floors come with hair dryers. Um, the dorm provides them for us, which is pretty nice. And then we have our sink area with soap also provided by the dorm. It's the exact same ones that are at Doshisha like campus. <laughs> it's the same with our kitchen. We have our dish soap is provided by the dorm. It's pretty nice. But over here is more sinks. We have just like three other ones over here in the corner. And then we have our small little hallway of toilets. <laughs> we lost her. We lost Allie, guys, in the toilet section. We'll try to get her back. Anyway, these are the toilets. <laughs> Obviously, we got Japanese toilets with all the buttons <laughs> that you could ever imagine. I'm back, sorry. No, you're good. I was going to say, we lost you in the toilet section. All the fancy stuff. Yes. And the little toilet paper and all that. And we have like a little trash that is also taken care of by our cleaning staff that we have here. They clean up the bathroom for us and the sinks and all the common areas really nice. And then we have our washing and drying room. Um, we have this one that's broken and is not in use. Um, but we have... We have five for a floor of 50. So right now I have mine down here waiting to be used because all of these are done, but people haven't collected their laundry yet. Um, and then we have two dryers, but you do have to pay for them. They are coin operated. But yeah, this is just our little laundry area. We also have like ironing boards over here. So that's nice. It's a little cute little area. And now we get to go to the fun spot, which is personalized units and room. So k is designed in a way that makes it so that you are interacting and spending more time with people in the dorm and less in your own room. Um, so you guys will see in a second. Our rooms are really small, but we have big common areas and big unit areas. But this one over here is mine. 3C. Your home sweet home. My home sweet home away from home. I have my name over here. San Xiong. Uh, uh, we do take off our shoes right here um, at our entrance area. We also have like little racks and cubes for our shoes if we wanted to put them on. But yeah, take your shoes off and then you enter. And this is what the inside of our units look like. Whoa. But yeah, each unit has like four tables here um, just so you can eat hang out um, we also have the tatami cubes things to like sit on or put your stuff on do you guys ever pull them out we do have like these four in the corner that are all together we also have a whiteboard in every unit ours just says welcome to 3c we just haven't gotten rid of it but yeah it looks like this from this corner just from when new people moved in we just haven't gotten rid of it it's just there but yeah it looks like this from this corner and then we do have this big fridge that we share with everyone in our unit with the freezer on the bottom oh whoa that's a huge fridge <laughs> i thought you only had the little one no 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 they used to only have the little one, according to like my old roommates, but then they brought in the big ones because the little ones was kind of impossible for four, maybe even five people. <laughs> so each, yeah. yeah, each unit has five rooms, but they're often not always used. My unit only has four people living in it. So our one in the corner over there has no one living in it. But this one is mine. So I guess we can enter. Yes. And now you get to see truly how small it is. <laughs> that is small. Yes, it is um, pretty small. Uh -oh. Are your walls in cement? Um, I don't th think so. They don't feel like cement. <laughs> I've never thought about that. But yeah, 
So when you move into Keishiro, what comes are in your room is you get this dresser here that you can put all your clothes in. There's like an area to hang them up. And then on the bottom, there's a drawer. And then you also get a bed, obviously. And from what I heard from other international students is that we are pretty lucky because ours comes with this blue mattress. <laughs> Um, and then we don't have to rent a futon or like our sheets or bedding because they are provided by the dorm. Oh, um, and then yeah. we get this desk over here. Mine's kind of a bit messy. I've been trying to go through things and pack. Um, and then we do have this like little drawer cubby thing on the bottom too. Um, and then we get this lamp that I never use, but it is back there. <laughs> and Strange then, question, but how many outlets are in your room? Oh, okay. Yeah. So we have this big one here by your bed that has four outputs on it. Um, and then we have another one over here that is just like a two one outlet. Thanks. You know what's funny is that's actually a lucky thing too because some dorms have like one. Oh, whoa. Oh, sucks for you guys. We have like <laughs> a lot. It does. Um, and then we also have a little balcony area to hang our laundry. So the idea of the coin locker or the coin dryers existing does suck, but we also have the option to just dry our clothes outside. So just is open. The, is the washing machine coin laundry? No, only the dryer. Oh, it's only the dryer. Okay, never mind. I take it back. And this is my balcony. So you have the little bar here to dry your laundry. Um, and I, I personally think I have a pretty sick view because I have the mountain in the background as well as all the houses. Some people just have the view of houses and they can't really see the mountain. I think it's cute. Especially like right now. Yeah, I know. Kyoto humidity is no joke. Um, but yeah, that's the aircon up there in the corner. And then I have my remotes by my bed for optimal usage. <laughs> We do have like a little thing over on the door where you can put them, but it's too far, so I never do. Okay. Yeah, I know that. The attempt at an angle of the really small room. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> You're welcome. Oh yeah, and we also have, as you can see with my one t-shirt, we have these bars in our room where you could yeah. like just hang up your clothes. Some people like, especially when it was winter, they would hang up their clothes here to finish drying after being outside for only a few hours of sunlight. Because so, they would just freeze or something? It just, there wasn't enough sun to actually fully dry your clothes. Yeah. But yeah, that is... How do you feel yeah. about everybody calling your dorm the prison dorm? <laughs> um, I actually would say they're not that wrong. <laughs> um... Do you agree that it's a little strict, or how do you feel about it? Oh, it is totally strict. It's probably one of the strictest international dorms. Um, at Doshisha, we have a curfew, um, not only just for the dorm in general, but also for our common areas. Um, so the one on our, on our floors we can use until midnight, and then the one on the first floor we can use Ideally until 10 p.m., but because it's exam season, they have been letting us stay later to study. Um, but they do try to tell you to leave once it starts getting late. They just, like, come and, like, knock on the door or something? Um, well, the common area on the first floor, they'll just come down and say, like, oh, it's already 10, it's already so and so, please, like, get up and, like, get your stuff. But yeah, do one more little once around up the third floor. Also, we don't have any, like, doors for the units. We just have these sliding things here. So it's, it's very open. Let's get the visual of what it's like. Oh, well, I guess... Oh, okay. You can go up until here, which is, like, that much left. And then it's this... I think that's it. I think I shall head down. Yeah. For the elevator. This is where we lose you one more time. The last time. Back down. And back on the first floor. And there she is. Elevator. What's up? You're back. That was actually so quick. <laughs> I um, recorded on my computer. <laughs> Hello.
we can we can get in here together. Last shot. In the case studio. <laughs> yes, exactly. Thank you, Rocio. You're welcome. All right. Bye guys. Bye bye.